Life.com. Life can be a circus sometimes, especially for a group of Valley kids. And Corey headed out earlier tonight to check out a unique program. And good evening, everybody. I've always wanted to join the circus, and now I've found somebody who can help me do it. Now, what's your first name, friend? My first name All is right. Christopher. All right, Christopher, show us your one hand juggle. Yeah, that's right. That's how we learn to juggle three by starting with one. And good news for us, we've got a guy over here who is teaching young people all of the circus skills they need to do what Jens has done. Wow, you're, this looks like one of the most difficult disciplines of all, the unicycle. The unicycle is so much fun, but it does take a lot of work. Yahweh here has been trying it for a couple weeks. Yeah. And he's starting to get it. What is the key? What, what do you, the what, key what's the most important the thing to remember? All the circus acts style here. Yeah, oh, it's the big finish. Is, is, is really persistence. Yeah. So if a kid decides they like something and they stick with it, they'll get it. Well, I love what the Phoenix Youth Circus Arts yeah. is up is up to, and we why lots. do you do it? Well, what's, well, what's the fun in it for you? Yeah, uh, well, circus is such a great way for kids to, uh, to play and learn to work with each other and also work individually. So we can make a big pyramid like a team, or they can work on their own on something like unicycle and kids that might not get into sports or dance or something find that this is their thing. Well, uh, this is great. Now, we've we've kind of jammed everybody in here all at once, but uh, you're a pretty disciplined operation. Safety yep. is key, of course. Yep. This is one of my favorite acts, this, by the way. This is called Rollabola. Yeah. And Gabriella here has just gotten started. Gabriella, nice work. There we go. I like the way you're not even looking at your feet. That's what the hot shots do. Am I right? Yeah, that's Keep right. Keep your eye on the horizon. Well, is this happening at all schools in the Valley? No, Something no. special here? Tell only, me about it. We're the only program that does this. Uh, we're doing this here uh, because we got a grant from the Arizona Commission on the Arts, so I want to thank them. Um, but we work with various schools uh, in different arrangements, usually an after-school program. Yeah. Now, so I see Stevie over here right. is working the big, big ball. That's one of my favorite operations. Now, I don't know when this comes into play. Oh, Stevie, nice work. All right. Now, to your knees. To when would you ever use this in real life? Could this help this you? Oh, absolutely. This is real life, 100%. What is your name, honey? Skyler. All right. Show us your good stuff. Now, I'm going to swing around this way. This is so impressive. Awesome. Yes. You're actually in the circus, Skyler. Is this is great. At this. You are amazing. Yep, yep. And style and smile. Oh, that's the big finish. Well, as we wrap things up, Yen, Jens, uh, tell me, friend, if you are, if I'm at a school, if I'm a principal, if yeah. I'm someone who wants to bring your fun to my school's gymnasium, how do they get in touch with you? How can we make it happen? Phoenix Youth Circus Arts, uh, phxyouthcircus.org, and we try to work something out. And we, we've got lots of great coaches here, Kendra and Stevie, yeah. and we've got about five or six, seven other people that work with us. They're all performers themselves, yeah. and they love to share what they're doing um, with the kids. I love it. Well, let's move out to the front. Hey, everybody, we want to see your big finish on three. Ready, huh? One, two, three. That's what we're talking about. Give them a big wave, everybody. Phoenix Youth Circus Arts. It could be coming to a gymnasium near you. Yeah, they did.